Constant Navy Patrol mission, crew members on a PLA submarine stopped their vessel from plunging into an underwater trench thousands of meters deep, averting a fatal crash. Jiebai has more. Reacting fast on board a submarine in the deep sea is a matter of life and death. Crew members on a routine PLA patrol mission had only three minutes to prevent their vessel from plunging into underwater trench thousands of meters deep. A sudden fall in water density and resulting change in water pressure damaged pipelines of the engine room. The danger was immediate. The submarine was sailing in deep waters and it was sinking very fast. So if we didn't move fast, the boat and its whole crew would have been pulled into the abyss in a very short time. Under the captain's order, the crew managed to close more than 100 valves in less than one minute. In two minutes, all the cabins were sealed. We seized the key three minutes to avoid a fatal accident, the tough training, spirit of sacrifice, and unwavering faith in teamwork were the weapons that we used to save ourselves. The vessel submersible system was restored to normal three hours later. After the subsurface, senior officers on board decided not to report incident. The submarine finished its mission and returned safely to base. The captain and his subordinates were given a military second highest award. This reflects the PLA's pledge to reward practical military experience rather than rank. Jie Bai, CCTV. The country is the last leg of Premier Li Keqiang's three-nation tour in Asia and Europe, where he will attend the fifth Greater Mekong Sub-Region Economic Cooperation Summit. It will be Li Keqiang's first time at meeting. It's expected that more enhanced cooperation between the GMS members will help regional integration. Su Yuting has more. The Greater Mekong Sub-Region Economic Cooperation Program was initiated by the Asian Development Bank in 1992. The GMS is composed of six member nations in the Mekong River Basin, China, Myanmar, Laos, Thailand, Cambodia and Vietnam. It aims to link the six countries through improvements in infrastructure, trade and investment and economic growth. Experts say Lee's attendance at the GMS meeting will play a crucial role in pushing forward sub-regional cooperation. The main model for cooperation is the projects. Well, by the end of last year, uh, there are 260 projects in, in this framework. And it, it includes um, almost 17 billion US dollars. And this means a lot of opportunity for the regional development. And primarily with this time means China's uh, efforts to play a more important role in the framework and China's efforts to contribute to the regional development. GMS cooperation covers various sectors, including transportation, energy, environmental protection, human resources, urbanization, and tourism. The area boasts abundant natural resources and huge growth potential, whilst there are still challenges ahead.